Welcome to Drill Down Earnings. We have the latest look at Marvell Earnings, that giant chip maker. This is the business story behind one stock on the move. I'm Corey Johnson, the chief market strategist for the Future Home Group. Uh, why do we care about Marvell? They make networking and data storage chips for cloud computing, automotive, communications, other stuff. They sell a ton of chips, nearly $5 billion worth a year. So it really gives us a read at what's going on in the rest of technology. And now this is Q1 earnings for them. A beat or a miss is all Wall Street cares about. And this was a miss, although it was better than their guidance. Specifically, $1.16 billion in revenues, gross margins of 45.5%, um, uh, and a diluted income uh, per share, 25 cents, whatever that's worth for shareholders, I guess. But uh, what was really disconcerting here was the fall off in growth for this company. So negative 12% on a year-over-year -year basis. Just not good for this company. And data center revenues of 70% of the, so if you look at the entire Marvel universe, not to be confused with the Marvel universe with Thor and Iron Man and I don't know, the Black Widow, whatever you got. But the Marvel universe this quarter, 70% of revenues were from the data center business. So uh, although that data center business was good, carrier infrastructure, and it, look, how good? I'll tell you in a second. Carrier infrastructure, enterprise networking, consumer, automotive and industrial. Um, the data center business was good. It picked up a lot. 87% year over year, year growth was great, but everything else was shrinking for these guys and it hurt them. In particular, I noticed the carrier infrastructure business, pow. Sorry for the comic book jokes, but it's called Marvell. What am I supposed to do? So pow, the carrier infrastructure business is really collapsing down 58%. All my friends in telecom know that that business has really struggled post COVID. So how did the stock do? Well. I think the world kind of knew this was going to be a great quarter. The stock was off only about 2%. And indeed, for the year, the stock's up 21%. Not great, worse than the S&P 500, but we've seen worse. So when we heard from the CEO, Matt Murphy, uh, he was asked about beyond AI in the data center, what's working and why are other things in data center besides AI growing? Here's what he had to say. We're seeing growth in both AI and standard cloud infrastructure. And we see that continuing throughout the year. And then as it relates to the on-prem piece, which has been very depressed relative to just what's happened with traditional server shipments over really the probably the last eight quarters or so, we do we do very much uh, see a bottom in our in our first quarter in that business. And so that's gonna be part of the growth throughout the rest of the year as well as some of that coming back to normalized le levels, some of the gross margin improvement we can look forward to as those businesses recover. So second half of the year, we've been hearing that for a while, but gross margin, improve, gross margin improvement for Marvell or gross Marvel improvement, whatever you want to do. Things are going to get better for these guys in the second half or so says the CEO. I'll believe it when I see it. All right, what's it all mean? The drill down earnings takeaway and one number that tells us a whole lot, the drill down earnings bite. I'm going to have that for you right after this. The Drill Down is brought to you by Futurum Group, where analysts, researchers, advisors, content creators, and marketing experts help business leaders anticipate and understand shifts in their industries and build strategies to leverage disruptive innovation. With deep analysis, Futurum Group's extensive industry experience delivers reliable research and data, thought leadership, and actionable advice to help you with your strategy and go-to-market efforts. Futurum Group. So in summary, Marvel Q1 results, we've got $1.16 billion in revenues and 45.5% gross margins. That's okay. These guys can do better. They say they're going to do better in the second half. But I promise you, the drill down earnings bite, one number that tells us a whole lot, everything about this company, 87%, that's the number, because 87% growth in the data center business was fantastic, even though the rest of the business didn't do that great. All right, thanks for listening to Drill Down Earnings. Check me out on X at Corey TV, Drill Down Pod on Instagram and on TikTok, and of course, Futurum's uh, web uh, page on uh, YouTube. Full of all kinds of great stuff about semiconductors and beyond. Drill Down Earnings, part of 6.5 Media.